Welcome to this war of mine. Wait, wait, no, 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 that can't be right. Huh, well, despite looking suspiciously similar, this is actually Into the Dead, Our Darkest Days, which is a similar side-scroller survival game as this war of mine, but with an undead twist. We head back in time to the 1980s, fighting to survive a post-zombie world deep in the heart of Texas. Now, despite having a wide variety of characters to choose from, I choose to play as the most stereotypical Texans, Sebastian, a hard-ass ex-military boomer who loves his guns, and Diane, a bartender who, despite the entire world falling to shit around her, is still optimistic about her DJ career. Will we be able to survive long enough to find new shelters outside of our tiny home, or fall only to be reborn as the walking dead? I am Bowen the Great, and I hope you enjoy the video. People of Walton, this is your mayor, John Ward. Now, I want to take a moment to thank y'all for your patience and resolve. You're welcome, mayor. Times. It's that southern spirit. It's that Texas grit. That, that Texas grit. grit. Full confidence that we'll not only get through this crisis, but come out stronger on mm. the other side. We'll uh, see about we that. wish I could be here to see it, huh? However, folks, I regret to announce that today I'll be moving on. Getting the hell out of here. You're on your own. No, I respect it, really. Now, no need to go assuming the worst. <laughs> <That's probably. laughs> this move is strictly to facilitate better coordination with our boys in uniform, who are at this very moment putting together a surefire plan to retake our city. And eradicate the... Huh? Can't wait. Where? Just give me a minute. So... So just, uh... Hold tight. Secure your homes. And I assure you... Hello? The tide will turn. God bless you. I'm not sure if anyone out there is still listening to this trash. Mm -hmm. But if you are, know this. Nobody is coming to help you. <laughs> There's no plan. They... <sighs> Look. What they did... It's wrong. It's all wrong. We are trapped. And staying here... Isn't an option. You have to get out. Escape the city any way you can. Get out now. I'm for it. Dang, that's got me kind of fired up, honestly. All right. So, oh, you can actually choose different survivors. I like it. So it's kind of very Last of Us where it sort of like pairs you up with two people. All right. So sebastian and diane so sebastian's gunsmith marksman kind of a gun dude jaded moral is restored slower than other survivors um diane untiring optimist every phase interesting is it like turn-based poor craftsman barricade repair is less effective uh daryl iron stomach that's actually really funny he looks like a, like a dude with an iron stomach that dude could throat so many glizzies um whitler melee bad cook nice Leo, tough, slugger, voracious. Loses more hunger. Yeah, I feel that actually. This dude is motherfucking Jeffy Dahmer. I guess it is like in the 80s. It does take, take, take place, place in the 80s, so it does kind of like, you know, has that look, but it would be funny if it was like uh, right, Hector and Kayla, Gearhead, Fortifier, Insomniac, Evasive, Escape Artist, Lightweight. Dang, there's a lot of people. First aid, good cook, pacifist, blade, sneaky, haunted. Oof. She was like the girl from uh, Stranger, Thing Stranger Things. Okay, I think I'm just gonna go with Sebastian and Diane. Just because, like me, good old fashioned uh, gunslinger. Daytime, Wednesday. Oh, 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 this shelter won't do. Find a new shelter and move in phases. Each day is split into two phases daytime and night. During a phase, you can assign survivors, confirm actions. Wah wah wee wah. Okay. Oh shit, they are there. Mm. 
All right, what is this? Repairs. Okay. I guess we need to add that. So is she now working on that? So then I switch. Okay, I can switch to him. Wait, is this a gun? No, it's just a, a light. So we need to find a new shelter. Prepare, scavenge. Some cupboards. Hmm. What that does. I feel like I need to stick with the task at hand, which is survive. So it is kind of turn-based. I kind of like that. That's kind of cool. All right. So then let's let's go. Can I go upstairs? Why can she go upstairs, but I can't? Oh no no no! You just press W. Oh okay, well, that's easy. Um, so I barricaded. That doesn't really make a lot of sense. I'm gonna take a nap, Diane. You keep working. Can I go into this room? Hmm. That will be fine. They're 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 plenty. They're they're they're, they're fine. I ain't scared of those things out there. Hell no. Um. Okay. So, do I have a gun? I thought I had a gun. But I don't have a gun yet. Ain't no point in just waiting around. All right. So I guess while she's doing that. I don't like the idea of going by yourself, but I think we're gonna do it. There's really no other option. Scavenging tools, lockpick, go scavenge. I wonder how this is gonna go. I wonder how quickly I die. I just die. All right, so then I just okay. So he's doing that. I, I just I end my turn basically. Oh wow, they're gone for good. Well, ain't that something? Oh shit. I was like, I thought this person was naked. Oh, we got us some fuel. Let's take it. Why not? This has really this War of Us vibes, and I'm kind of about it. Okay, we definitely do not want to... Uh, Move into doors to peek. Okay, there's there's a zombie in there. Do we do we still go in there? Or can we like do something different? I there's really no other option, so I guess we're going in. If we die, we die. Well, we're going in, folks. Can we sneak past them? Wow, we can. She has no idea. Huh. Dumbass. All right, let's go in here. My God, don't open the door so aggressively. Yeah, let's not um, disturb her. She's she's busy. All right, do some scavenging. All right, so we got raw meat. Yum. Just put it in your pocket. Oh, so you don't hold it. Okay, I just I've been like holding it. Uh. All right, well, let's just let's let's go out. I don't think you can go like down hallways or anything. I hear one. The sounds, the guttural sounds in the game are very eerie, to be totally honest. Let's peek. Ooh, new locations discovered. Scissors. Oh, I have a weapon now. Scissors. King scissors. Well, you're on your own. Okay. Well, let's get a little bit more finite here. Forever really isn't an option. If you've been here, if you've actually been there forever, then you're probably dead, and there's really no point in coming to get you. Okay. With the weapon equipped, sneak behind and press E to stealth kill. Just, wow. Just really got in there. Well, now that I know that, I'm going to go and kill this other person. And maybe I can, like, you know, scavenge that one room. Maybe this will work. Maybe it won't work. No, I can't. 
That's really pathetic. I'm not going to just avoid that altogether. I'm not really a fan of that. All right, we're good. Can we loot his body? Nope. I was going to say, I feel like we got to be able to loot this here shed. Okay, now we're talking an axe and wood and metal. Head back to shelter. I like that. I, I do like that scavenging feature. That's kind, that's kind of fun. Nighttime. Not good. Alrighty. She's done some work. Now, how do I share? Okay, the undead managed to hold them back this time. Okay, so basically each de each cycle they destroy some of the uh, stuff. All right. So the good thing is is that we now we have a pair of scissors. Actually, who does who's who's better? Does it tell you? Range weapon. So he, this is a total like range weapon guy. So whenever you have a range weapon, he gets it. No. Oh. What in tarnation? Okay, th that's just because he like. Okay, let's switch to her. Survivor. All right. Low loses rest slower. That's good. Optimist. Barricade repair less effective. So the fact that I had heard on barricade repair was kind of stupid. So that ain't that. That's that. That's not good. That's not good. All right, so she's going to have, I guess she'll, she'll get these, the scissors. We can make it. I agree. Optim See, like, that's that optimism. I'm a big, like, be optimistic person. All right, yeah, because he can produce three. So this is definitely the vibe. So let's add this to Q. Oh, shit. Nope. How do I remove? Oh, that easy. Okay. He's busy. She ain't, I'm tempted to have her sleep. But I'm also, I, I don't want her exploring at night. And I don't want to do that either. I don't want to control her at night because that, that's going to open up a whole new can of shit. Oh, this is a new shelter. Both of them are going to get a good night's rest. Assigned survivor. You're going to get a good night's rest. Nope. All right, so are you. Because we have barricade, like we have uh, barricades left, so there's really no point in not just taking advantage of this. There we go. Y'all two cuddle up. Get a little rest. Boom. Feeling good, right? Oh wow, so it doesn't destroy the barricade when you do a night cycle, it's only during the day? I don't know. Odd. All right, prepare to scavenge. You get the axe. And then let's bring her. She's kind of hungry. You'll be all right. All right. Wait a minute. Interesting. So she cannot scap. She can't go with him. Well, ain't that some shit. Well, that was a waste of time. Can she do anything? I, I don't want to, like, waste wood. I don't, I don't, I don't want to, like, waste wood on repairing if I don't really have to, so... All right, well, she's just going to hang tight. I guess we're going to go... I didn't realize. I didn't realize that. Value records. I ain't playing no games now, partner. Oh, it seems to be empty. Shelter equipment. Someone held up here. Ain't no way, partner. <gasps> Just bludgeon them to death. I like it. The pure violence. Okay. Is there... Okay, yeah, I can just quick transfer. Ooh, that is a nips out zombie upstairs. Oh, it's propped. Interesting. Maybe it's like go all the way around. Let's figure out the best way to handle this scenario. I'm going to wait for him to come here and then behind him, poof, get him from the back. Special, 99 cents. Yeah, you know that it's like a long time ago because 
Vinyls do not cost 99 cents today. Okay, buddy. This might be way, might be cutting it way too close. No, I got I did it. That was actually very close though cuz he was about to turn around too. And that was a little bit unnerving. What do we have in here? I can't see a damn thing. There's YOLO in it. Ah. Oh. Wait a minute. Wooden box. Okay, we'll take it all. Wait a minute, what? There we go. All right, there's a body right there. Hopefully it doesn't wake up. No, it didn't wake up. I would definitely du be double tapping though. That is faux show. Okay. Ah, oh, we can just move this. Oh, here, now we're talking a broken pistol. Shit, I thought I like had a, an operational pistol. Oh. I don't... No, I can go this way and to get behind it. Got it, got it. I was very confused for a second. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> uh, I was like, what do I do? How do I... What, what am I doing? Okay, I, I clicked to attack it, it. The tutorial tells you everything, but not like how to defend yourself. I was like, what? You know, one would think. All right. Oh, relax. Oh, this is what the, uh, the barricade was. Goodbye, chair. Okay, let's go out back and see what's up. All right, so now I can move in. Let's do it. Let's head back. Diane, I got some good news. I found a new shelter in a video, in a, in a, in a, in a, in a, 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 a store of whatever you were, a store of all sorts. I ain't feeling too good, though. I got kind of lit up. I ain't scared of those things out there. I tell you what, stop calling me a scaredy cat. All right, I'm a little bit effed up right now. All right, so how do I... Okay, move shelter. Be unassigned, any craft in process. Okay, let's do it. Nighttime might be a bad time to do this. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Cool. Oh no. All right, so we can craft stuff now. Portable bed. Communal area. Oh, that's kind of cool. Cooking area. Now we're talking. Oh, baby. Let's do a cook. I feel like cooking is like extremely important. Oh, wait, he's crafting right now. Okay, so he's crafting. Um... Cause she's she's ass at crafting in general, or is it just barricades? Okay, barricade repair is less effective. So maybe, actually no, we have we we, we got time. So what can she do? Oh oh yeah, let's send her on a little quest, a little quest of souls. Let's do it. When we come back, we will have a, a we can we can cook food now, which is pretty important for survival. I would I would argue food is pretty important for survival. There are Z's everywhere. Look for opportunities to climb. Ooh, this is cool. Oh, there is a zombie right there. Oh no, don't. This is gonna be really loud, isn't it? Is she gonna break through or is she gonna like casually lift it up? Okay. Whew. Crouch, bitch. No, don't. Wait. that at all wait she has scissors oh shit oh god oh my god there's even more 
So are these zombies like just in the back? Like if I stand up. Okay, it aggroes instantly. Oh shit. They are not just for show. No, turn around. Oh shit. Run! I screwed myself. Okay, listen here. Climb the f down. Oh wow, they just really went for it, huh? Oh shit. Finish her. Wow. Shit went really sideways very quickly. Did not expect that to happen. Oh my god. Alright, so our test is conclusive. These zombies in the background are very much not for show. They are very much a part of the game. Oh, that could have gone really bad. Actually, it did pretty go, like, actually went pretty badly. So, what is this? Firearm parts. You get me a fucking Glock 40 problem solver, and this shit is over. Crocky. What? What does this mean? Remain calm. Lead discover lead discovered. Remain calm. Before you leave, pack clothes, bring evac papers, bolt all doors, take inventory to the storage unit. Interesting. I'm doing this even though I feel like it's gonna be a mistake. Bop them! <laughs> Good luck, asshole. We got food, which is what we need. So we're about to have cooking done. Uh huh. Please tell me this ladder kills this zombie right here, because if it doesn't. Okay. I don't want to go in that house. I really just don't. I know that something's going to be really. There's going to be a lot of stuff in there. Ooh, can I. Can I, oh, I don't have a fucking lockpick, you idiot! She's not too tired, which is good. Where's the, um... Ah, oh, here we go. Now we're cooking. Meat stew. Uh... Vegetable soup. Moderate amount of hunger when consumed. Let's do it. I probably should... Let's see how, how much our... You know, he could eat. Let's just cook two. That'd be kind of rude to just only make one and be like, Yeah, I'm gonna eat this. You're on your own, partner. So let's do that. Well, two during, you know, two this, and then... Alright, yeah, I'm gonna roll... You know what, though? It takes time to craft. Screw it. I'll craft two. And I'm hoping that I can go back to the other location, because what I do not want to do... How do we consume food? Oh, yeah. That wasn't really a lot at all, my god! Oh my god, that's only a quarter. Okay, well. She's pretty injured. He's pretty injured. And she gonna be bringing that axe with her and a lockpick. I'm hoping that I can loot that container thing. And in the meantime, he homeboy's gonna hang back and craft some more barricades up. Because we're starting to kind of, you know, dwindle down a little bit. Oof. We got. L Wait, can I go? I can go on the roof. Ugh. Idiot! I totally forgot to do that. Ever get like new um, spots to, you know, do, you know, do, scavenge, if you will. Yeah, small spots to scavenge. Let's see what we got. Taxi depot, precinct station. Oh, an arcade. Let's go, baby. Probably no power to it, so we can't really, you know, have fun. We're real fun with it, but. Alas. Alright, we'll, we'll sprint. We got... We got... It. Whoa, let's... Yeah, exactly. Take the ladder. Don't just yeet yourself off the edge. Alright, so... All we gotta do is open this bad boy up. And we should be set. And this place will be fully looted. Hell yeah. That seems like it's really loud. You know... Electrical's good, but I feel like that was kind of a waste. Oh well. Yeah, I mean, honestly, that was pretty solid little scavenge. Didn't get injured, so that's good. It's rare. 
Wait, Diane lost healing? Okay, she hopefully healed. Yeah, she's fully healed now, so that's good. Daggum. Hungry again, huh? Alright, so I'm gonna have her cook more food and maybe honestly send him back to scavenge. Can I get more survivors? That would be kind of cool. Alright, so let's let's do that. Let's I'm gonna cook two more meals. Honestly, she just might get each. Actually, I mean hell, like at this point, like let's cook four meals. I don't think it like goes bad or anything. He's a little bit sleepy. Pull thing. I would imagine let's go check this place out. Harsha Presbyterian. I gotta. Oh no, I didn't heal either. Shit. Hopefully, hopefully I don't take any damage. Also, doing this at night was a very interesting option choice that I that I did. Let's see what we got here. PSA flyer. Bring only what you need. Leave valuables and non-essential items at home when your household number is called. Head toward the district's designated evac point. Hmm. Propped. Shit. I guess we have to go around. Got a little supply, though. Water is good, for sure. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. There's going to be zombies all up in this bitch. Alright, we cannot make a sound. This is going to be an escape point. An escape point, if you will. Holy shit. Yeah, this dude has got seeds because they are fucking everywhere in this. Oh, God. At least they're not like runners. Oh, Christ. Let's see, like, if this person, if this zombie turns around at all. So I would hate to open this door and then aggro everyone in this church. All right, I don't think she's moving, so let's just... Excuse me! Just right in the old, uh, brain. All right, so we can go upstairs, but let's check here first. I don't like this. <coughs> I don't like this one bit. I'm gonna go upstairs. I don't know why I feel more comfortable going upstairs, but... I wonder if there's like, big zombies in the game. Oh shit. Oh, this one is moving around. So when he gets to this door and turns... Booyah! Bitch! Oh. Interesting indeed. Let's do it. I feel like the surefire way, way in an actual zombie apocalypse to get yourself bitten is to... Is to... Hold on. Left ship to run. Okay. Is to, is to do this at night. Oh. I was going to say, you MF or you hold on for dear life. This is, yeah, like, I got it, like, it, the description is very on point. It's basically just, like, basic building supplies, or base supplies. Should I just ring the bell and just aggro all the zombies here? Yes. It would be funny if I actually gave you an option to do that. Old Ballard Fire Station number eight. I feel like that, that'd be a good uh, place to hole up at. Wait, there's a survivor? Hey, howdy! You know what? I was literally just one. I literally just said before I did this, like if you can find more people, um, increased chance of being sick. Classic. I love your hair, Rahul. Happy to have you. Look at us. All right. Everything in my brain is telling me to not pull this, but. 
to, it'd be stupid to pull this, right? I mean, like, why would it give me the option, though? They're breaking it. Something. Yeah, I mean, nothing happened. I can pull it again. That dude's like, could you please stop? Yeah, I don't really think that was a good idea, but I guess we're about to find out. Wait, so is he coming with me, or is he just going to, like... Yeah, who knows. I feel like I hear a bunch of zombies. Oh, I pissed them the fuck off. Oh, Lord. Yeah, they ain't happy. This was a very questionable choice, ringing that bell. I guess... I... That was really stupid, wasn't it? Oh, shit. Now they're like, they're moving like hell. This was, that was, ringing the bell was a bad idea. Oh my God, they're fucking everywhere. Wait, what is she doing? Okay, you know what? I think this place is cooked. Okay, yeah, it's cooked. We're getting the hell out. Are they below me? Oh, shit. What the f- What do I do? I'm trapped. Yeah, ringing the bell was a terrible idea. Who told me to do that? What, which one of you told me to do that? <gasps> Fucking idiot! Oh my god. Oh my god. Run, 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 run. They're very fast. We're gonna jump. Combat roll. Go, run, idiot, run. That hurt me. We're getting the hell out of here. Holy shit. That almost went sideways. That kind of did actually go sideways because your boy, your boy ain't mentally good right now. We've made a lot of progress though. I'm sleepy. Oh, we have Rahul. All right, so you are going to bandage yourself. This might be good though. Too. I can't craft it right now though. Mm. All right, communal area. He's crafting a communal area. Because I think morale is starting to really start to, or at least Rahul is kind of like not feeling life right now. Uh, she's sleepy. That's fine. She's going to go out on a little expedition. Ooh. Old Ballard. A few artifacts of, um, okay. Ooh, a new shelter. We'll wait a little bit. I kind of want to send her back to here because we really did not do everything that we could have. Well, uh, Move quick and quietly. Boom. Oh shit. That was actually really good timing. If I come out of this untouched, that would be amazing. I'm very touched, but barely touched. That was actually like, whew. Oh, a police baton. I like it. All right, let's not screw ourselves and like sprint through it all. All right, so now this is good. We have a lock pick. Oh shit. Beer. Hell yeah, partner. I don't think I can like quietly go through that. Actually, I do oh, hold on, there's another. Oh baby, junk food. Um, Can I just use it? You know, I gotta feel that I'm gonna have to probably leave this. Oh, what the? Oh yeah. Okay, bitch, relax. Did she just aggro everything? Oh my god. All because I sprinted like an idiot. 
Oh, what the fuck? Well, that was lucky. I thought for sure that she was going to hear me because I didn't realize that I was not crouching. All right. Wait a minute. I must miss this. Strange mocking. So there's some old graffiti in the back fence of the church. The tag looks like a round maze with paths. It's probably an inward. In the bushes, there is an old stormwater grate. Plum with brown leaves and nothing else of note. All right. Let's go back to shelter. That was a pretty good run. He's good. He's very sleepy. God, I need a break. I saved your effing life. Be a little bit more, like, you know, good about it. All right. So he's kind of hungry, always. Um, so we got supplies to... He's, he's just always hungry, though. So let's just... Can we eat this? Yeah. That's actually, that actually works out really well. All right, so we need wood is what we really need. God dang, we really do need wood, don't we? I thought that we, I just, what, what did I just craft? Oh, I, I crafted a, um, a spot where I can like play cards and stuff. So we need wood. We have plenty of like nuts and bolts and copper and wiring. So realistically, we could craft this with no, with like, it won't affect our workbench upgrade. Let's, let's just go ahead and craft this. And then she'll sleep tomorrow. All right. Oh, let's not head back to the shelter already. Where do I go? Oh, I gotta hop over this, huh? Oh. This is gonna really suck. I just have a bad feeling about this. What? Brother, you gotta go. Get up! Oh my fucking god! Bitch! I thought that shit was about to aggro every zombie in the background. I was about to be just screwed. Oh, what is this? A symbol marks the concrete near the drain. A broken flashlight lies on the pavement nearby and jagged pieces of glass crunch underfoot. What the hell are these strange markings about? I, I feel like that like the more you play, the more you'll like figure out. I need wood. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. I got a feeling that he was about to come back. So I'm pretty sure I just saw him right here. Alright, we're gonna wait. Not do anything stupid, like ring the church bell with a bunch of zombies at night. What the? You couldn't climb over that a little bit softer. Well, oh fuck. Well, there's that. He might as well like he just can leaped over that thing and just screamed out as loud as he could. Hey! Oh shit! All right, let's just go upstairs first. <laughs> oh shit! I can time this up perfectly so that, yep, he turns around. And your boy's gonna do the old, uh, from the, hit him from the back. Clap his cheeks. Let's see what we got in here. Any Z's? Nope. God, open the door more gracefully, please. I'm begging. I don't know how they don't, like, see me. Can't imagine why I would want to go out into this. It's kind of like a emergency exit. So I'm gonna do the old. I'm gonna close this door actually. Oh my god! Why does he so aggressively do that? God dang! That's, every noise he makes is just so aggressive, and I'm like, dude, you've got to. St Wait, how the hell are there zombies up here? <gasps> shit! 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 I think what I'm gonna do, I'm not gonna leap over this. I'm gonna get to that thing right there and then hide behind that and wait. Actually, no. I'm gonna wait for him to like, yeah, here we go. All right, we're good, we're good. I think it's gonna aggro these zombies, so we're about to find out, I guess. Don't aggro the zombies, don't be too loud. Whew. We're good. 
Oh my god. There's so many down here. Shit. I can't help but think this is a bad move. Oh, this, there's still more. You don't really need the lockpick in the first run, though, which is kind of nice. Oh, shit. I, I think this, we just go right upstairs. Or, can I even do that? Alright, I'm going to try something really daring. I'm going to try and open this door, kill this one without aggroing the other one. All right, that went poorly. Some would say things are not looking good for old Sebastian. Huh. Well, boys and girls, I don't think Sebastian's gonna make this one. Oh, good. Ah, oh, yes. He gained grief, lost dis lost drain, so that's good. Well, at least we have a medical station built. Oh, things are going sideways right now, too. Okay, all right, so we got to, we got to figure this out. Raul, you are on barricade duty. Actually, you know what? We probably should just get the f out of this area. Wait, do we lose all everything that we've crafted? I guess we're about to find out, because... Yeah, guys and girls, we gotta we gotta get out of this area. This things are going really poorly. All right, do we want water collector or fire station or garden? I feel like water collector, food and medical supplies. F this, we're going to the arcade. God damn it, that sucks. Sebastian was like the the man too. I kind of screwed up. My my plan. She didn't turn around as fast as I was sort of hoping. Oh, I oh, need power turned on. Oh, wow. Okay. I can't see a fucking thing. Holy shit. This was maybe a very risky move here. I can't fucking see anything. Peek your damn flashlight through there. Like, anyone home? I'm trying to see if I, like see anyone walking back and forth, but it is so effing dark. All right, we're just gonna, we, we, we gotta do it. Do it for Sebastian. Zombies can't see flashlights, can they? Yeah, they definitely can. This is a very risky choice. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Space mark, space mark, space mark. All right, let's, let's, can you combat roll? You know how to combat roll, Raul? I know things are really dire right now, but we're gonna need you to really pick things up. Oh my God. Okay, things are not going well. I could see Raul not coming out of this one alive. We're gonna try our best to keep him alive though, but no promises. All right, we got a lot of wood though, which is good. I feel like the flashlight really kind of screwed me. Oh shit. Is that a moon? Oh Christ. Oh shit. I almost just can woke that mother that mother trucker up. Oh I can't. Oh no, I can't see shit. Oh, it's barricaded? Oh fuck. I am not mentally okay right now, folks. I am and I can't you can't see fucking anything. Do I go this way? I feel like I should not be going towards the zombie sound, but I am. I'm like a moth to a fucking flame for some reason when it comes to that. Alright. I don't see anything. They're like fucking all around me. Fuck this. The power's off. I can't open this stupid gate. Holy shit. Oh. This is gonna awaken everyone. Lord, give me strength. 
Oh no. Go through this. Oh God. Oh my God, that's so loud. Everything is so loud. You know, it makes life a little bit easier though, or nicer. Can I hide? No, I really can't. <gasps> what the? F Give him the old one-two punch, buddy. We got this. We have to got this. What the hell? Am I not doing damage? Raul, buddy. Holy shit. Why didn't you instantly equip the damn scissors? Oh God. All right, this is not looking good. I don't see a world. Yeah, we're gonna keep it real. Raul, things are looking pretty bleak. Do we have any, like, first aid? Shit. We're gonna have to play really soft right now. When I say soft, I mean soft as a fucking baby's box. Like, can I use this? Like, will this do something? No, this only like heals bleeding. Oh, I was gonna say like we should just at least record our last moments. Can I consume this? Oh, I actually just did by accident, and that's not gonna help me at all. Though, it's the only thing. Oh fuck! Please give me like a big daddy. Oh shit! Not a big fan of what I'm seeing right now. Oh. Alright, I can maybe... Let's not be stupid about this. Let's wait till the mf -er actually turns around. Okay. One zombie down. A f ton left. Alright, let's play this smart here. Let's not... If a zombie comes this way... We're gonna be shutting this here door. Oh, a crowbar. That's kind of nifty. Um, let's get, let's put something away. Be quick. Let's put this video camera because we can't dismantle anything yet. So I can't help but think that the crowbar should be a better weapon. Oh my god, we're almost. I think we're almost at the end. Oh, she's above us. Remain calm. I am fucking trying to remain calm. You don't understand what's happening right now. So if I leave now, can I shelter here? I don't think so. I thought that there was like a, a moment where, oh yeah, you have to clear all the zombies out. No. Oh, what the f All right, I can't help but think right now that this is not a good, this is, this is how Raul dies. If I keep pressing on to try and clear the thing out. All right. We're gonna have to. We're, we're gonna come back here now. So the power is on, and it should stay on. So Raul's gonna get the hell out of here. She's gonna come back. Diane's gonna come back. We're gonna move the shelter to here. Is nighttime the best time for this though? Oh. Wait. What? Okay, Raul, you know, I, I, I truly, I empathize. I truly empathize with you that you're like in a lot of pain right now. But I'm gonna need you. I know that you probably want to, you know, do something else, but unfortunately I need you on barricade duty. Like, I know, I know you wanna craft supplies, but you're on barricade duty. Diane, I'm gonna need you to put the damn team on your back right now. Things are fucking bleak. Yeah, you, she, she does not even want to go down the stairs. She's like, eh, yeah, no, nah, I'm good. But I hear you. I hear you. Let's do it for Sebastian. What would Sebastian do? All right, we're going back. We got this. All right, crowbar. <sighs> damaged item. Oh, this is damaged. Got it. Okay, so we don't want to use that then. We'll just, we'll, we'll do this. 
Poor Sebastian. Poor Sebastian, truly. Are the zombies back is the question, though. The zombies are back. Please don't turn around. Ugh. All right, that's good. One Z down. Ample more to go. Please don't turn around. Please don't turn around. Please don't turn around. <laughs> Boom! You know, I'm actually surprised that Raul did not die. So we just need to go upstairs. Let's not get too cocky though. It's like getting cocky is how you get yourself killed. All right. Whew. This shit is fucked up. I feel like I should go upstairs. Oh. I quickly don't feel like I should anymore. I don't think we're good. Oh, the crowbar's about to break after two uses? You're kidding me! Got water, so that's good. Oh, the water collection system's right there. Sick. And what do we have this way? Okay. <sighs> Breathe, part. Oh, it's safe. But you need a lockpick. Yep. Should have brought a lockpick. Why didn't I? Actually, I don't have any, to be honest. So that's actually. <sighs> don't run. Don't screw this mission up because you decided to hurry things along. Slow and steady. Oh, shit. When's the race? <laughs> I pressed it, but it didn't react. I was like, oh no, I'm screwed. All right, I'm gonna go this way because there's another one over this way facing the door. Oh shit. Boom! Weapon destroyed. Damn it. Okay, the game should auto-equip the next melee weapon in your, or just weapon in general, because that is not ideal when your weapon breaks in your mid-combat. All right, this is how Diane takes damage and maybe dies. Ooh, that was violent. And I'm surprised that actually worked out as well as it did. All undead cleared. Hell yeah. Now we talking. Yep. All right, we're moving. Any crafting? Okay. So this is what we're about to find out if things that I crafted back at that location actually move with me. I would love, for, Raul, you have got to get over yourself. Oh, that is really good. I, th I think it does, or like, at least it's like maybe comes with it. Um. But yeah, all right, so we desperately, so Raul's about to die. So we're gonna craft a healing kit. This, I think this is literally just for like bleeding. So we're gonna craft a healing kit for Raul because you hit a homeboy. Oh, wait, this is a healing kit. That works out well. Oh my God, he's always tired. All right, we got cooking station, this. That's actually really nice. Yeah, so everything comes with you, which is clutch. And then water station. Oh, create filter. Next three phases. That is really cool. You just need cloth. Huh. All right, well, we're always going to be sleeping because he's being a little baby about it. All right, this is actually probably a good stopping point um, just because we've actually done a lot um, in, in this demo. The demo itself is actually really, there's there, there's a lot to it. And I got to say, I'm a sucker for like a zombie survival game, but this one just like, I, I really, really like it. It's a side scroller, so it's a little bit kind of unique. I mean, it's not your standard kind of first person zombie survival game, but across the board, I mean, the only thing that really kind of annoyed me is that when you break, like weapons break very easily. 
a crowbar should not last like four hits um, before it breaks. And then also that it doesn't automatically equip just because when you're in a bad situation, like you don't really have time to like go into your inventory and pull that shit out. So that's kind of annoying. But honestly, other than that, I'm really looking forward to this game. And I hope you enjoy the video and RIP Sebastian. Peace out.